In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a dynamic block for a door that you can easily adjust to fit your drawing. I'll be working in metric, so let's start with an 800mm wide door in a 100mm thick wall. The door leaf will have three positions, but of course, you can add more if you want. I'll also throw in a masking element, that part's optional. Inside the block editor, I'll add two linear parameters. One for the door opening width, and another one for the wall thickness. For the door size, I'll set up a list, and don't worry, you can change that later anytime. The wall thickness stays flexible, but you could add a list there as well. Both parameters will have their own grips. Next up, I'll add a stretch action to the door size, first for the parts moving horizontally. Then I'll add stretch actions for the 45 degrees and 90 degrees door positions. For that, you just set the angle offset to 45 and 90. For the arcs, I'll use a scale action, and for the wall thickness, another stretch. To make it more practical, I'll add flip parameters on the door and wall axes, and hook them up with flip actions for all elements. Both flips should stay centered, so I'll assign move actions to the linear parameters, set the flip parameter as the element, and adjust the distance multiplier to 0.5. I'll also drop in an alignment parameter. And finally, let's set up the visibility states. And that's it, the block is ready. Super flexible, super quick to use in floor plans. Thanks for watching.